Hi guys, welcome back. Today I've got five exercises that you can do to work your shoulders and arms with resistance bands. So this is something a little bit different. It's actually a blast from the past because I've been repurposing some video footage from old posts and realized that I never did a video for this blog post. So I figured why not just add it in as a little bonus for this week. So here are the five exercises that you can do for shoulders and arms at home with resistance bands. Exercise number one is a lateral raise. So we're going to start off with one foot in the resistance bands, one foot behind. Take a hold of the handles and then just lengthen the arms out to the sides, maybe rising about shoulder height and then releasing back down. If you would like this to be a little bit more challenging, you can put both feet into the resistance band and that just gives you a little more tension or strength into the band. You can also use a stronger band if you have a set. And if you would like a less challenging version, then just alternate right and left. That'll give you a little bit of break in between each repetition. The second exercise is a bicep curl. So you can then step in with both legs, arms resting in front, palms forward, bend at the elbows, drawing the hands towards the shoulders and then release back down. Try and keep the elbows pulled in. And again, if you want this a little bit easier, you can just have one foot in the resistance band or you can just choose a lighter band. If you would like this harder, well, there's a different option. You can either use a heavier band or you can do what I did here. This is an adjustable set of bands and I just put both ends of the resistance band into the same handle. And that gave me the opportunity to do a single arm bicep curl. Third exercise is going to be a front raise. So again, we're going to stand with one leg in the resistance band, both arms down by the sides, and this time have the palms facing down. And we'll start off by just raising one arm in front, palm will stay down towards the floor, and bringing the arm about shoulder height and releasing back down. And again, this is one of those things where if you wanted to, you could do both feet into the resistance band. You could choose a more challenging strength resistance band, or you can do both arms at the same time. If you're doing both arms at the same time, make sure that you're engaging the core to keep the torso upright. So the fourth exercise is gonna be a seated overhead tricep extension. So you'll need an anchor point for your resistance band. I've just threaded this through the fence post here. And you'll come into a seated position. The arms will be up overhead. The elbows will be nice and high and the hands kind of reaching back behind you like you were gonna try and tie your hair into a ponytail or a braid here. Extend the arms overhead, but keep the elbows nice and high. The biceps stay in towards the ears. Options here, you could do single arms, choose a lighter band, and you could even do this standing or kneeling for a little bit more of a challenge. And the final exercise is going to be a seated tricep pull. So these again have the anchor point and you will sit sideways to that anchor point. The arm furthest away from the anchor point will hold the resistance band. You'll lift the elbow up like you were going to take a sip of your cup of coffee. The elbow will stay nice and high, maybe around shoulder height. And then just extend the arm away from that anchor point, away from the shoulder, and then bend the elbow and bring it back in. Okay guys, for each of these, maybe do around 12 repetitions of your variation. Perhaps in between, if you want a little bit of a circuit workout, you'll do a minute of jump rope and a minute of each of the exercises. These are just suggestions. You find your workout that works for you. That is all I have for you today. If you enjoyed this, give it a thumbs up from a little blast from the past. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. And remember, my loves, that karma is only a bitch if you are. So be nice, be kind, and be the change that you want to see in the world. 
and if you'd like any more workouts then go look at my video library there's a ton of them and maybe i'll start doing some more especially pilates and tubing i love resistance tubing